Hello, hello and welcome back to Leaky Gaming and welcome back to another episode of Workers and Resources Soviet Republic and today we're going to be focusing on more problems. Right, look at this, <laughs> it works. Uh, these are Rob's street lights. Look how nice park looks at night. Uh, this is really nice. Let's enjoy this for a minute. Yeah, and I'm not, uh, I'm not calling the city plastic grad. Uh, definitely not. Uh, <laughs> sorry, Aiden. So we're gonna go, Mr. AM. We're gonna go, and uh, for now we're gonna continue like this until we get the better solution, or until we uh, touch the nerve of uh, wealthier. Uh, we're gonna, we're gonna leave it like this until he complains about it. Oh, look at this monument. It's working as well at night. Oh, this is cool. This is nice. Yeah, I think I should put more street lights. Look at the parking space here. Hmm, interesting. Lights in the cars are working even at night. Look, even vanilla uh, game is not perfect, you know. When uh, Vico makes a, a motorcycle that has a rider on there, look, look, vanilla is also, uh, let's call it broken. I'm kidding, it's not broken, but it's not ideal either. Okay, so let's go and check out the financial system because, <laughs> yeah, good old financial system. Because we, uh, what did we do here? Okay, we imported a lot of vehicles, so we cannot really take this um, as a measurement. In this month, we had also a couple of vehicles imported, at least one. That would be, I think, food truck for delivery of food uh, to one of the shops. But that's good because that's going to lower the imports, which we are not doing anymore. So hopefully uh, our people are not going to starve because we're feeding them our own food. Okay, anything else? We can go and check overlays while we are here. Uh, let's see how many apartments we have. Uh, let's go for three kilometers and the numbers. 170, 150, uh, that would be just over 300. And then we have 400 over here. Uh, with these, let's go with these 300. Uh, we have around 500 apartments. Now this is filling up fast. I'm, pr I'm predicting by the end of the episode, we're gonna have at least 200 people more. Uh, Right, uh, I wanted to mention something else, let me real quickly check this out. Okay, uh, there is dawn, new dawn is dawning um, on the Discord now. I just wanted to mention the... Tarum, 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 tum, tum. I wanted to mention that uh, Mikil, uh, Mikil Levka... Uh, Miki Levka... Um, he mentioned that in four years he had uh, 12... Uh, 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 how much yeah uh, 12,000 people in four years we have 5,000 in three years and it's September so it's gonna be well it's gonna be four years soon so he has doubled the population I don't know how much he started with for now we are doing fine I would still like to get this unemployed number a little bit higher just to be safe no, just the industries we have they don't have the capacity to handle this uh, what I'm gonna have to consider here is another school I'm gonna take a sip of coffee I have a big mug of coffee 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 yes me learn talking um it's sunny day actually in dublin today it's 9 30 in the morning saturday when i'm recording this so happy weekend guys i should probably have margaritas for breakfast or something like that but um yeah yeah grandpa soul cough medicine okay so uh we talked about the helicopters as well we only have 600,000 rubles left i think and this is still gonna come uh for payment all of this uh, steel that we just um that we just uh, installed in these silos, and silos are progressing quite fast, I have to say. These silos are at... Look at look at them fly. They literally need a crap load of concrete, and that's it. Unfortunately, we only have one concrete construction office, and uh, currently we have 85 tons. We, we need another 380 tons of concrete. Let me see where the vehicles are. And there are they going around? It doesn't matter. They have to go around. I don't want them to go through the city. And yet, here they are. Uh, whew, I don't know. I don't know how to stop them. Uh, maybe they are the ones that started going this way before we implemented this. I wanted to buy a helicopter because I, I thought uh, Copti confirmed that we should have another helicopter here. Uh, just because this big project we have, uh, I will be delivering all the materials on our own. You can see that people are being delivered as well. This is great. 
So we are we having workers here get delivered by helicopters. The only thing we're not gonna be able to deliver is the asphalt. So that's fine. Uh, that's perfectly fine. I will buy through this. I will. Uh, oh wait, that's unfinished road. Crap. My bad. Uh, the pipe system here. The only thing we won't be able to deliver was is concrete here. Uh, but everything else is going to be delivered by helicopters and let them work slowly on this. Like I said, we have coverage of all of this and we are running at capacity. 150% is the uh, capacity for all connected buildings. Uh, and the other one here, it has a really low capacity. So this is not going to help us that much. Uh, this one is going to be taking the brunt of the uh, workload. Uh, that being said, um, I'm gonna say that 150% uh, is what it can handle. It can handle 150% and since it's not gonna be really 150%, uh, closer to 120% we still have capacity. With 150%... Really? Okay, this is becoming uh, interesting. Yeah, I think I want them in this direction. I don't know where all these people are going. Uh, this is the the train station. This is where they're getting most of their workers. That's fine. Do I want to maybe tell tell people to get workers from here, from this bus stop? No, the bus stop is actually quite small. I'm not happy with the bus stop. I'm thinking about making a, a bigger uh, bus station over here. You know, for, to get your people and whatnot. Uh, public transport. That was a coffee time again. These buildings are probably going to be the last I'm going to build for now until the heating system is uh, constructed. So uh, we're going to have to focus on finishing those. Okay, uh, future projects. Again, population is going to be the key. I need to see if these guys have everything. So heating is connected. That's fine. Uh, let's go with uh, the let's go with the furthest house here. You have heating. Yes. Uh, there's nobody living here at the moment. That's fine. Uh, do you have water? Yes. Do you have sewage? Yes. So all of this is covered. Okay, that's really nice to see. Electricity is covered. I don't think there's anything else we can do around here to uh, keep these people happy. We need to uh, extend uh, increased capacity of heating and um, schools. Let's see walking distance. A shop is right there. Pub is right there. Uh, we have a train station uh, next to it. We also have a bus station uh, only 270 meters away. That's not bad. So that means school is going to be uh, covered as well. But we will need another school. And I was thinking maybe playing with the population a bit. Um, just testing this. Again, I'm going to uh, point this out we have 32 uneducated workers and i have no idea why they are not getting educated i have well i have an idea but i'm not sure if that's true i'm thinking because they are there's no school in walking distance when they go to the bus station they are actually acting like um they're acting like workers. They come to the station not looking for education. or They only look for education in walking distance. I think so. I'm not 100% sure. And this is what I wanted to test as well. How did we connect these two buildings? Well, not too shabby. You can see a little bit of uh, uh, spacing around here. Though, but, but not too shabby. Do we have different skins for this one? Because they look a little bit different. No, no. Maybe it's a charm of this building. And uh, they are kind of connected decently to each other. No, I'm happy. I'm happy. I'm happy. I'm gonna leave it as it is. Uh, this is uh, Hull IW84 WB. Okay, this building. Uh, right. Uh, how are we doing with the industries? Nobody's working here. That's not ideal. What about this bus? Only 21 workers. This is strange. Why is this uh, power plant and mine getting all these workers and we are not getting any workers here? So we have uh, 110 people here. Let me see how what the trains are doing. I would assume that both trains are waiting all the time constantly to be loaded. But no, look, uh, the other one just went there. How fast are we producing this coal? So this train just left. Yeah, let's let's check this out. Let's speed uh, things up a bit. I think all of our construction industries, everything is uh, functioning fine. Um, population. Yeah, the, let's talk about population. Look at this. He's already at 100 tons. I'm pretty sure. Let, let's speed it up. Let's see how fast he's going to get there. So Mikil Beka had the 
in four years 12,000 people and I challenge accepted not really I'm not I'm not uh, playing challenges uh, but I want, what I wanted to say is oh we can deliver steel here right oh they need uh, do they need people here well, they have helicopter construction ops. Anyway, anyway, we are at 200 tons over here, and uh, this is uh, one third of the train. Uh, one third of the train uh, we get uh, with the, with this production. But again, bear in mind that we have really low production here. Uh, 50 people building building. Again, population, population, population. We need an enormous amount of people for this. And this is what I wanted to talk about now. I wanted to talk about getting more citizens and i wanted to talk about these uh, dollar ones uh getting citizens for using dollars so let's do this are we gonna get 75 people just for testing for now uh, i'm gonna go here and get how many 75 i'm worried that they're not gonna get education but let's try it what we're gonna do now is import uh all 75 people uh, you can you can see that we get some of them with education uh, it's it's mixed bag also when you buy the when you get the import people for rubles you get some college educated as well but for now these guys are looking fine okay so we, we will monitor this we have 91 uh, um, the workers uh, with low education so you can see here workers uh, uneducated 91 I'm pretty sure they're not gonna go uh, they're not gonna go to school because they're not age uh, students but if we build a school right next to them i think we might educate them i'm not 100 percent sure you can see here there's no they're not acting like students you can see look they're not acting like students they're all acting like workers they're gonna go shopping they're gonna do this here this and that but um they're not students uh i didn't connect this shopping center that well and i really would like to do so uh, how do I want to do, go f with this? Uh, like this. Let's let's be smart. Let's go like this. And here uh, they have entrance over there. Let's go this way. Nice. Oh, building in a way. There we go. And here I think we are we're fine with this. No, uh, no, no, no. I would like to have. Well, really? Okay, this one looks um, a little bit on a weird side. Let's remove this one and then let's construct all of these because they look nice. And let's go and try this one one more time. Okay, he wants to go in this direction. He wants to probably go in this direction as well. Well, you know what? Why wouldn't be? Why wouldn't be? Let's give him like this. Okay, so we're going to have more connections. Okay, let's continue on. What I'm going to do now, uh, speed through the night, I will go and check our construction office, uh, groundwork, to see how much work they have. Next to nothing, grain storage, it has everything, it has even people there, it requires 237 tons of concrete, that's going to take a while for us to deliver. Uh, we have here unfinished heating pipes, uh, they require footpath office, that's perfect, good, good catch for me, yay, go leaky. The greatest ever something something uh brick building do we have trucks coming in yes you have that's fine uh these brick buildings uh, and brick house uh brick brick house really that's a brick house that's not a house that's an apartment building why does it say it's a house doesn't matter um right so we're gonna slow down we're gonna go and build a new school uh this school does have capacity should have i gone maybe for better public transport system and then connect it to this school to utilize it to the maximum extent it's over it, i think this school here it's over um overused i think uh, it has it's too much i think 800 people for this school is too much and i remember presenting this mod and uh, they said that it is that's how many students went into this school but i think it's a little bit uh, too much i will go and build a new school around here i'm just thinking uh, how far can these guys walk to school 300 meters i'm thinking that if it's going to be covering this or not you know what um yeah, let's do this. I'm going to build a school over here. We're going to go for school, 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 uh, school. Okay, which one? Which one? Old school. What's an old school? Uh, that's really too old. No. Uh, we have some school over here. This is not bad. What's the capacity? 
Oh, 700. What's the deal with these? Seriously. Vanilla one has 120 kids. But again, this vanilla one, it has freaking two floors. I'm pretty sure that this can handle more than 120 kids. Actually, I don't know. Like, that's, that's four classes when I went uh, to school. We had 30 kids per class. No, no, no. They can handle more than that. I have no idea why they're so small. Well, 700 might be a little bit too much. But uh, school 60s. Here we go. This is Rob's school. We're going to go and uh, level the crap out of this place. And I can see straight away that uh, uh, I shouldn't have built this because we're going to need some terraforming and probably this one as well. So let's just remove some of this road here. Uh, uh, footpath. Uh, just a little bit. And then uh, flat, 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 flat. And here we go. We're going to go for a school over here. It's going to be... I, I might even go for replacing the school. Uh, this one over here because... Uh, I, I, I don't like I don't like the capacity of the school. And the city center, I mean, like, you wouldn't put a school there. I have no idea why I put it there. Uh, right. That was the, the world building series. You never stop me. That's why. I blame you guys for everything. Uh, kindergartens. No, we need schools. Here we go. We're gonna go for Rob's school. There we go. Just as a punishment. Punishment for whom? I have no idea. Let's go for... Let's go for this one here. Okay, and we need to connect it with mud road so they can start construction straight away. Uh, shrink, shrink, shrink. There we go. Build it. Wow. This is the best you can do. Wow. Go away. Let's try to do better. Nope. Nope. Uh, there we go. Let's do this. Okay, uh, let's go for some monuments as well. Uh, they have a library across the school. That's kind of fitting. That's really nice. Uh, monument. We need a monument here. A big one, right? Um, vanilla, maybe. Maybe like this. I don't think this is the worst thing ever. Yeah, kids need to remember where they live. Soviet Republic. Uh, I won't get any workers now because we don't have enough workers. 4%. Uh, oh, okay, okay. Something changed. We have from 92 down to 87 uh, people not working due to low education. That's interesting. I still want to uh, build these schools. That doesn't matter. Okay, so Miki, uh, we're gonna get you. We, uh, Miki, we're gonna go and get you because we can get 12,000 people by the uh, year four like you did. I'm kidding. I, I'm probably not gonna rush for 12,000 people, but I think it's really important for us to... Uh, wow, is, is it just the went from 87 to 86? Okay, okay. I, I have no idea what to, what to say here. Um, they have 75 out of 75 people. It doesn't say how many kids we have here. So, so nothing. That's it. I, I can't do anything about this. We can monitor this number and see how many we're going to educate. And um, uh, that's going to be the guidance for us. Uh, workers working on the groundwork. That's useless. We need uh, uh, equipment because it's going to be too slow. Do we have equipment? Yeah, we have equipment. Are you coming along? It's coming along. Okay, I shouldn't be focusing on this alone. Uh, I should be focusing on this. This is going to be uh, the bottleneck that we are experiencing now. This is going to be the biggest bo bottleneck we have, and the helicopters will have to deliver all these um, uh, materials for us. Now, is it even uh, possible to think of this? Like, is it reasonable for us to think that helicopters will deliver this? Now, machine parts, board, that's fine. Uh, gravel, probably, yeah. Okay, this little part, yes, but this one here is going to be challenging. Uh, 64 tons of concrete, that's forget about it, but um, uh, 267 tons of gravel, that's challenging. Uh, and helicopters, are you flying? You're flying. Where are you flying? Here we go. Helicopter is there. How much are you carrying at the moment? It's going for one and a half ton. Jesus. Okay, I wish, guys, you said, am I a dumbass here for speaking this kind of crap? Uh, by saying that these um, uh, pipes are not supposed to be uh, constructed like this. That the uh, game is broken. I said it. Uh, I wish you confirmed or denied if I'm an idiot for thinking this. Or am I right for thinking that this game is broken? period, um, because of these pipes. I'm going to say period, but uh, because of these pipes, for example. This is going to cost us a pretty, I mean, geez, 118,000? I mean, like, most of it is going to be steel. 100 tons of steel, 118,000. How much is steel these days? Wow, we're going to have to start producing our own steel. Uh, steel, steel, steel would be here. 
400. Okay, so the steel is not majority of the of the cost. So uh, majority of the cost is everything else. So I think I'm gonna leave it as it is uh, and just um, you know uh, save some money. We really don't need this heating, but this is interesting. This part here is quite, quite interesting. We're still missing this uh, road. We're going to go for construction. And we're going to go for footpath. No, let's go like this. Yeah. Construction is going to need to bring electrical components and steel. Uh, we're going to require a little more gravel for the sidewalk, but that's it. Uh, yeah, so this one is... Uh, this is just temporary situation here. Because all these trucks, they need to go and... Uh, uh, semaphores... No, no, no. This is temporary solution. You see only these buses, they're all delivering people to, to these construction sites. And we only have one road connecting this neighborhood. We are building alternative road. We are building it here and we're building it here. But unfortunately, we are, it's still not done. And I don't believe in semaphores. I think semaphores or uh, lights uh, are, are a problem here. Uh, our problem in the world. It's just too slow going through the lights and uh, they're just stopping the traffic. Roundabouts are much better. Um... Who saying roundabouts uh, much better? Maybe I should have gone for a roundabout. Maybe I will. Maybe I will eventually. But uh, like I said, this is currently just temporary solution because all of these vehicles are going there just because of the uh, construction happening. And why are these big vehicles, uh, concrete mixers, going through the city center again? And I prevented them. Probably they're saying that, they, okay, we're delivering stuff. No, you're not delivering stuff. Is that heavy goods vehicle? What the hell is a heavy good vehicle? Okay, uh, do we have any other signs? Let's see. I know what's a heavy good vehicle. I'm just saying, like, uh, what does this game consider heavy good vehicles? No heavy goods, heavy goods vehicles. Okay, I can't stop them all. Well, what is this? Okay, no overtaking by heavy goods vehicles. Yeah, is a mixer heavy good vehicle? In my book, it is. But they're using this city as a as a freaking you know. So it's a racing track. I don't like that. I don't like you. Anyway, uh, there's nothing we can do here. I think we can... Well, I mean, we can do... We, oh, right. Why wouldn't we do this? Why wouldn't we... Uh, number three. Let's go number three. Uh, and then number two. Let's do like this. Excuse me. Um, right, let's do like this temporarily because this is the most important. So uh, this road needs to be cleared as soon as possible. So... I mean, we're gonna see backlog of, uh, of vehicles over here, though. Ah, oh, spy car. Spy car is going this way. Yeah, temporary, I think this is uh, counted as a main road. No, maybe not even temporary. We can Maybe we can permanently do this. But this is gonna clear out traffic. I don't think semaphores would uh, would clear this up any better. I know, no, no. I, no I, I'm 100% sure that um, semaphores would not uh, handle this better. But while this is still, this construction is still ongoing, let's see how much uh, materials we need to deliver. Uh, some. Uh, some, some, not not too much. You can see here how many uh, materials are still needed here. We have here 48 tons of bricks. That's a big one. Everything else is one or two trucks. So we're more or less done with this. Here, look at this. The heat, ex uh, the heat exchanger is is done. Uh, we're mostly we're mostly done with this. Okay. Uh, what did I want to build here? So we have a school. That's fine. Yeah, you can see backlog of trucks now. Uh, they're they're backing up here. Why is this guy not going through the intersection? Look at this. This game, again, the game, game mechanics here. This one is not turning. He's going straight. And he's not going straight. That's weird. This one was turning, but um, yeah, it was creating some problems. For example, this bus is going straight. Okay, okay. It's understandable now. It's still. It shouldn't go. Okay, this one is going to be the hardest thing for him to turn here. Yeah, I'm fine with this. Uh, we can test it with semaphores if you guys want this uh, while we have heavy traffic here. Okay. But uh, I'm pretty sure that this is not supposed to be happening. Yeah, I should have bypasses. I should have these bypass roads everywhere uh, before I started construction. Maybe I should have built mud roads because they don't have any alternative here. Because these these roads... These roads help a lot. Hmm. 
No, I'll, I'll just leave it as it is now. Uh, I should have built a, a mud road parallel to this one or finish this road before I started any other construction. Okay, but we'll th we are thinking ahead. New school. Uh, we're gonna remove this school eventually just because I think it's... Um, I don't wanna say it's a cheaty one. It's not really cheaty. Wow, over a thousand kids now. Did we increase productivity or something? No, it's still 89%. Uh, that's fine. That's fine. Okay, so new school is being planned. Let's go and enjoy the night uh, night skyline of our beautiful little city. Uh, I don't want to go overboard with our high-rise buildings, even though these ones that we are constructing at the moment are a little bit on a high, high side. Uh, this silo is progressing suspiciously fast. Again, this is uh, night farm life. There we go. On scaffolding, enjoying. I don't know if you ever didn't. If you never had a beer at night, uh, uh, you know, on a construction site or, or some high, high place, uh, and you know, just enjoy the the um, you know the evening and stuff. Oof, that's the best. I don't know if it's best, but it was nice. I remember. I have. Whoa, that was really unexpected. Okay, uh, I'm expecting this. Uh, so, um, do we have any problems with picking these crops up? Absolutely, we have a lot of problems with this October. We only have one month uh, one month to pick all the crops up. Okay, so time uh, now it's the time to uh, Take care of this total capacity. Do we go for big ones? Uh, you know what? Since it's gonna be ten of them. I'm gonna go for big ones. That's ten thousand ten of them That's gonna be hundred thousand rubles for these trucks. I'm not gonna go for this I think these are extreme and they look quite modern and nice and uh, I, I like these they're more they look more uh, like agriculture vehicles they have bigger capacity and uh, yeah let's let's fill all the way we are down to half a million rubles which is kind of problematic but um uh, whoa, 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 whoa slow down slow down buddy boy um right they're gonna be filling this um ooh. Oh, right, I think we can handle this, we can handle this. Oh, we need to upgrade the roads, but uh, we can upgrade some of the roads straight away. So, for example, this one, uh, we can go for footpath office. Foot, foot, foot. Really? It doesn't give me footpath office, this is incredible. Um, well, let's go with construction office, they have buses as well. I know I can do it manually, but I don't want to. Okay, so, and also this one, they don't need to go into this silo right now, uh, they're gonna be delivering everything into the farm, so, uh, let's go like this, uh, I don't know which one is entrance, which one is exit, oh, maybe I should do all of them then, let's do all of them then, because nobody needs to go into the silo at the moment, so, I think they're gonna be fine, road here, road here, they're gonna deliver that, this construction vehicle just needs to, uh, deliver... This construction vehicle needs the uh, construction office needs to deliver people. Um, I probably should have gone for this footpath. Yeah, a footpath has capacity. They're, they don't. They have nothing to construct. Construct. So yeah, let's assign. Uh, I shouldn't have gone with the second one, but just the first one. But footpath should be constructing stuff. Let's see. Wow, they're so fast with constructing anything. What am I supposed to give footpath to do now? I mean, like, construction of the what we have here, there all, all the locals are going to be working on this. Uh, we cannot assign them to these, because nobody can be assigned on these, because Uliki, um, uh, spoiler alert, Uliki is going to be bitching for next 10 seconds, uh, because game is broken and it doesn't allow us to build this. I mean, like, it's not a big deal, I understand, and I'm not giving Mr. Moore excuse not to play this game, I'm just saying that uh, game is broken, <laughs> the game is broken, you can't construct this, and this is all vanilla, why is that vanilla connected to this? Even if we had the road on the other side, it's still three segments, we wouldn't be able to construct this. I mean, it's unreasonable to construct this with helicopters. Oh, I forgot to sing this. It's unreasonable for us to construct it with helicopters. <laughs> game is broke. Okay, yeah, let's go. Okay, continuing on. Uh, new schooling system, we have new immigrants, uh, down to 80 uneducated, 79 uneducated people, they're getting edumacation, they're getting edumacation, uh, that's really, really great, uh, I would really like them not to have locals work on this, oh wait, uh, is there a me mechanism coming here, Škoda, yes, yeah, get, get everybody away from the construction, I'm gonna finish it on my own, because we really don't have capacity for, okay, this one needs to be finished, this one has everything, so we can move this from the, from the construction queue, 
Uh, what's with this one? It has everything. Cranes, you have cranes. Perfect. You can also be constructed. Because it's going to take only seconds for them to construct this. Uh, this one is done. Um, since this education system is working, I'm all in getting more, um, more immigrant workers. I am immigrant in Ireland and uh, I welcome everybody. That's how we get in. We put a foot in the door and get all the immigrants here. I am kidding in real life, but um, here I'm definitely for this. Um, right. Uh, using dollars, I think our educational system can handle this. I'm just thinking if they're more burden to society. No, they're gonna, they're gonna definitely contribute. Let's go here. And let me see this. This school is in walking distance to these buildings. Why am I doing it here? Let's do it over here. Uh, we have capacity over here. How many? Ten. That would be 100 additional people. Should we round the numbers to 6,000 or something? I mean, like, especially if it's here, they're in walking distance to school. Uh, let's let's fill this building up. Okay, 5,747 workers. We have 8% unemployment. Uh, they didn't work due to low education, and this should change. This is going to change soon, shortly, shortly. Okay, uh, what do we want to focus on here? Uh, anything else? No, we are at 30 minutes now. It's a little bit more because of the intro, but uh, we're going to have to finish this soon. Unfortunately, because I really want to uh, play more. I'm thinking about recording a few episodes, you know, in advance. Uh, not that I don't have time to record, but because I'm enjoying the game and I want to continue playing it. Wow, we have another building constructed. How are we doing with the living space now? Let's check this. Or making episodes longer. No, I don't want to make episodes longer. No, no, no. Because uh, I know it's it's uh, it would be great, like, for you guys who are watching this, it would be great just to, you know, have more more to watch. But also, like, you know, not a lot of people want to watch, like, hour-long episodes. And not a lot. Some of you do. Some of us do. I used to like that. Not anymore because I don't have so much time. But um, I think uh, most of you guys, well, <laughs> talking about, um, uh, you know... Uh, uh, <laughs> having an overpass here but people not using it to go on the other side uh, because it, it's a mod it, it doesn't allow people to go through it unfortunately it would be cool if it did though um anything we can do here no construction stage needs to be uh, we need to deliver these materials but i'm really happy about this 263 people are without education i'm pretty sure uh they're gonna be educated quite soon Anything else we want to cover? Again, Leaky is not noticing the messages. He's uh, experiencing happiness is too low. Let's see. This is go away. <clears throat> Wait, uh, train waiting for too long. Okay, not anymore. Happiness is too low. Okay, let's see. Why is happiness too low here? Hospital. Okay. Workers cannot work due to sickness. Uh, let's remove these, uh, and this is the happiness. Yeah, let's uh, let's build a hospital over here. Uh, it's gonna be at the edge of the city, uh, F2, to see what kind of gradient we're working with here. Uh, we definitely need a hospital. <coughs> wait, wait, wait. This is not that far. 390 meters. Isn't there any chance we can cut this short? Ooh, I think if we have no. This entrance is relatively... Look, it's only 10 meters. Like, uh, no. I, I don't think we can actually make this any shorter. Um, underpass, maybe, but uh, for one building? Nah. I think we our hospitals are going to need uh, more capacity anyway, uh, eventually. So I think we're going to have to go for another uh, hospital. Uh, where I'm going to build it? Uh, uh, is this road done? Not yet, but soon. Uh, Alright, we need a construction office to deliver all these materials. That's perfect. And then uh, this one is already done. You can see this road is done. This one needs a uh, construction office to deliver all these materials. And uh, we can go for hospital over here. What's the, with this? Oh, right. This, foot, this road is not needed. There we go. Uh, hospital over here. How high is this in the hills? Hospital on a hill. That sounds like a... Better love story than Twilight. Uh, I, I actually never watched Twilight. <laughs> I, I know the meme, though. Uh, right, hospital, hospital. Now it's going to be comment section full of, yeah, sure, you didn't watch it. All right, this is the one that we can uh, potentially put around here somewhere. This is the hospital that goes underground in Sarajevo. This is also, uh, this is also Equinox Nova's mod. Um, 
hospital how how big i think this is i think this is decent enough uh, let's go like this we're planning for this we're not gonna do it right now we i want to finish the road for actually do i need to finish this road yeah yeah we have people here and the stuff is coming they're gonna finish this fast okay that's it we planned a lot we're building a school where we finished the silo uh we bought new vehicles we are almost bankrupt so you know uh, i think we're doing a good job you know especially with being bankrupt so there we go i'm gonna leave it here i'm gonna say thank you for watching hope you enjoyed this one if you did press the like button if you didn't leave a nasty comment in the comment section let me know what you think, like, subscribe, notification bell, ring it, comment, search, hit it, and if you want to support the channel, we have the description of the video. Thanks for watching, guys, and I'm gonna see you in the next one. Bye-bye.